Hello there, everybody. My name is Ayumu, and this is Nuclear Throne. I'm back, and it's got a new update. So let's do it. So, <laughs> like, except loads of balancing. Except that. So I can actually look at the more in depth. But the labs now it's a loop boss and Necromancer reworking. So I believe what that was is that uh, you it actually counted as a kill every time you uh, managed to kill one of the things that respawns uh, and I believe that's been worked so that doesn't happen now so after several videos of embarrassing play uh, the performance of a lifetime I needed, I just took a little break I needed to get my brain situated and into the mindset of victory so we're gonna play as YV on this who has a good ability but I wind up not using it very well most of the time. I guess high accuracy? Well, not literally your own, like the game's high accuracy, but being able to actually hit something helps out immensely with this fellow. So, that is something I have been far, far from doing recently. So hopefully we can get our stuff back together, be, be confident, in our play, it's like when I when I was a kid, if there was a game I couldn't beat, I took a break from it, and then you know I I would stand a chance at it. It's like you gotta you gotta get out of the negative mindset, because sometimes that is your worst enemy. Just being negative. So don't be negative. Be positive. I'm also I'm using a loadout. I'm not super comfortable with. Mostly just a laser bit. I love the shotgun. But the laser pistol is not my cup of tea, necessarily. We're gonna take, uh... Damage taken stealth to all. We're gonna take sharp teeth. I've been... Before, I was taking gross amounts of damage. And, uh, well, that's not, uh, not a good thing. So we're gonna take uh, we're gonna take some steps to mitigate that. Like right there. If it wasn't for sharp teeth, we may not have uh, made it out of there as easily as possible. And yeah, a little bit of rushing. They say a little bit never hurt anybody. It did. Wound up murdering me time and time again. So I don't actually know how much damage. Uh, sharp teeth actually does, but very embarrass embarrassing damage. But that's okay. I don't have the fastest weapons, so it's it's acceptable. Loosely, and that was almost my death right there. And that was my death. I'm okay with that though. We're gonna do another practice run. I need to work on why these. Now, out of all the abilities, it has my favorite name. It's just a fun name to say. Just like, oh, what are you doing? All right, level two is good. Uh, Rhino skin might become like needed. I might be in the wrong mindset where I'm like, oh, well, what about all these advanced things that I could do? When in all honesty, I'm just like, you know what? Dodge and shoot. It's like, you know, Mega Man, you can have all those cool abilities and everything, but ultimately, you jump and shoot, man. If you succeed in jumping and shooting and not taking damage, well, you've won. That's how you win Mega Man. You jump and you shoot. Of course, Mega Man isn't literally that cut and dry, but, you know. It's never a bad idea to get back to basics. And today is back to basics day. I've been playing, you know, a little too loose, trying to think of, well, trying to get more in over my head for what my ability has. But you shouldn't also talk yourself down. You'll be like, well, well I mean, I'm bad, so I shouldn't, uh, I shouldn't aim for better things. No, 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 that's not how it works. You, you believe in yourself, you try, and you pick yourself up after every single loss, 
And what you absolutely make sure not to do is shoot a grenade launcher around this dick bag. Actually, there's nothing wrong with shooting the grenade launcher around him. It kills him very quickly. I was actually uh, trying to reference the cacti, which can ruin many of uh, many a fun run. I want that assault rifle. All right, let's get rid of him first. All right, there went my cover. Uh, I like the slugger more. All right, it was there was only one bad hit of damage though, and we did get another. Did not. Did not get another level. That's okay. We don't need that other level yet. I like the assault rifle's good for its spammability. Especially when things get pretty crazy and you can't hit anything. It does work out pretty good. And you can send out six shots right away. Which works out real nicely. But you gotta be careful. Because uh, right there, uh, that's that's an example of why I'm I'm bad with the right click ability. Because a lot of times I wind up hitting it at the wrong moment and missing. So I might uh, actually need to take a break from right click ability because that that's messing me up. It is a fantastic right click ability. Thank you, strong spirit. You have made me look a little, barely, but a little less terrible. Um, I'm gonna go with Bolt Marrow. Eagle Eye is really good too. But at oh, thank you. Right now, what I really need is just to follow the basics. Don't get hit, and you survive. You don't need strong weapons in this. Well, actually, you literally do for uh, the throne. But until the throne, you don't necessarily need strong weapons. If you just never get hit, it's melting without any HP or strong spirit. Granted, that's like uh, just be perfect. So it's not the most sound meta. But if you aim for better things. With the damage I've been taking, I think we're going to have a... Just spam. Spam bullets. It doesn't matter. I, I would leave this floor with... Well, I don't actually want zero bullets, because that would, that would murder me, but... I would leave with basically zero bullets, because if you... If you die, you're dead. People die when they are killed. It is... Some very, very tough meta right there. It's like, you need the rads to get stronger. But if you died getting the rads, you all, all you did was make yourself weaker. So I'll forsake all of these rads to keep myself alive. Also, because that guy was there. Otherwise, I probably would have made a, a valiant attempt going in there. Let's just leave. I I like the slugger. I prefer the shotgun. Because of its spread. Right, that's okay. Only one hit. And we have a toxic bow. Oh, we have homing bolts. Are we, are we really going to do this? This is dangerous. I can't use the toxic bow. Effectively. But, live and let live. This isn't the daily, so we can learn from it. Some kills. I'm going to go with open mind. For more chests. More chance for items. That's actually what I wanted out. Full health. Well, that's what I like to see. Just, excuse, excuse me. Excuse, sir, sir, please. Please excuse me. Excuse me! I would like to... Thank you. Appreciate that. Get out of here. Me. Sir, can you just... Uh, I would kindly appreciate... Go. Get out of here. 
What we got? Energy hammer. Oh my god. But want the energy hammer? Alright, we don't want the energy hammer. Energy hammer is really good. Yeah, we work. Number one thing to get rid of is gonna be. Oh, definitely get these rads. The toxic bow. I think it actually might be weaker than the regular bow. I mean, yes, it does have the toxic effect. But it also means I have to stay away. Plasma gun. Buy toxic bow. I know we did specifically take homing bolts, but. No. Alright, so we'll, we'll double hit when we can. So make it so like. No. I spend less time potentially diving in and out of enemy fire. Four. Mm. That was actually pretty good of him. I, I don't feel bad about level four. I'm sure you guys have something to say about level four. We're going to go in. Also, I, I didn't look at Throne, but my daily was a couple days ago. Also, it was probably like play 700 or something garbage like that. So, I'm not, uh, I'm not too worried. I'm not trying to hide it. You saw how bad that play was. I ain't hiding it. But I also forgot to look it up. I got outside of my typical meta of looking everything up. It's not even a meta. It's just, I have it. Get what needs to be gotten. Get your levels. Fight for your right to... I don't know. Be a... Mutate? Mutant? Mutated guy? A, a Illuminati symbol? Yeah, fight for your right to be an Illuminati symbol. I believe in you, friendo. Uh, brat is good. But when you can't successfully, you know, hit anything, a quad reload, time-wise, is probably not what you're looking for. And this will help me out when it comes down to... There we go. The, uh... The... Come on, words. Someone also forgot to turn off Skype. That was me. But having the Plutonium Hunger is going to help out a lot when it comes down to getting what needs to be gotten. You know, I don't have to necessarily dive in. It'll come to me. Assault Rifle. I think it's coming down with us. Strong Spirit is a must. I would like to take Laser Brain to make this pistol a little bit better. But I can't argue with... Uh, the fact that I have, uh, well, played very poorly. And that's... Gotcha. No one's fault but my own. So I'm hoping, uh, second stomach... I don't think I've seen second stomach yet. Today. Second stomach is what we're after. With plutonium hunger. And second stomach. Or, I'm sorry, and, um... Yeah, plutonium hunger, second stomach, and... Strong spirit. Oh my! Had a little, uh, had a little dirt fast right there. That should help me out a lot more. I'm gonna go with boiling veins. It's not my favorite one, but at least I won't die from an explosion. I don't know if that affects cars being thrown at you, because I don't know if that's an impact of a car being thrown. Maybe you take like less damage. And it's not just a guaranteed kill. Should we get all the hits in there we need? Uh, flamethrower is interesting, but I don't think it's a wise decision, at least. At least not for all the bad play I've been having so far. 
So we are coming across some ammo problems. It's not the end of the world. Let's check out the rest of the level. There's no more of the level. We'll head out of here. But the, the peace of mind... The peace of mind that Boiling Veins can give you. Also, I know that I won't walk into a fire trap and be a huge idiot. That is priceless. We'll, make, we'll get Strong Spirit. Well, we never lost Strong Spirit for that. We'll be back at full health, so Strong, strong Spirit, if we lost it, would be back. We're taking some embarrassing hits. That's okay. No one is perfect. Are you Stop that. I don't want you to blow that up. Uh, that's a wrench. I don't want the wrench. I still don't feel super comfortable. I'm actually going to take patience. We'll, we'll, we'll do a mulligan. Because I think right now, I need those core mutations. But ultimately, I need to be dodge and shoot man. That was bad. Not unexpected, but bad. I don't know what kind of killing potential we have. I like the position we're standing at. Give me oh, hello. Just keep pumping in bullets there. We got him. Birdman. Just a regular machine gun is not what I'm looking for. And a screwdriver is also not what I'm looking for. I feel weak going down to this floor. And we're going to take... Oh, goodness. Um, Bloodlust? I guess? Yeah. I'm feeling a little more than a little weak. And this is where Plutonium Hunger comes in super well. Because I'm not strong. And then this will make it so I don't have to dive in there or miss everything. We got a bazooka. Okay, you know what? I have boiling veins. We're going to do it. It's going to be scary. Uh, I thought about keeping... I didn't even see that strong... Seem that strong. There we go. We'll double bazooka. That's, that's what we're using this for. Uh, assault slugger, yes. Okay. Okay. See, that, that's why we took Boiling Veins. That's also why I don't normally recommend... Uh, I don't recommend this setup. Also, we are dead. We are as dead as can possibly be dead. Rabbit Paw is... Can you be my savior, Rabbit Paw? You know, all things considered, I feel okay. Yep, it's Explosion City now. Double explosion. Yeah, I need I need a new weapon. Uh, my ammo economy is as bad as could be. All right, let's just miss this one guy like a hundred times. What do we have? Hyper Rifle. Sure. It's a Hyper Rifle. Oh yeah, Hyper Rifle! Hyper Rifle's pretty good. It's a huge ammo sink, though. But, should hopefully keep us alive. Uh, take in! Uh, is that Double Flame Shotgun? If it's Double Flame Shotgun, I'm taking it. I gotta take Back Muscle. It's just a regular flame shotgun. I think I'm going to take it for economy's sake. 
You gotta, you gotta keep the economy alive. Thou shalt not anger the economy. Okay, that energy sword is very tempting. Desperate times, you shoot. Worry not about the small man, you shoot. There we go, we got strong spirit back. We got Seeker Shotgun. Seems good. Because this is, uh, how many does it shoot? Three at a time. I don't feel like I can go with it. Believe me, I want to go with it. It seems powerful as well. Laser pistol. It's not very powerful. We do actually get to bring the shotgun down with... Did it bounce out, or it did not? Okay. Here we go! Just got up. Alright. Well, we got there. And that's all that really matters. I'm okay with that run. That run doesn't make me feel like I'm a big poopy head. Not a great score. We don't have much left of it. So that is basically representing my score. Top 1,000. I'm okay with that. Thank you for watching. I feel a little bit more confident now. I hope you have a fantastic day. Or night. Or whatever time it is for you. But thank you. And I'll catch you later.